welcome to the breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to install Forge in Minecraft 1.11. But first, remember this video is brought to you by Apex Minecraft Hosting. You can go to the breakdown.xyz slash Apex. First link down below to get an awesome 24 hour Minecraft server that can have Forge up and running on it with just one click. It's pretty freaking awesome. Anyway, let's go ahead and jump in to how to install Forge in 1.11. Now, first off, we need to download Forge. So second link down below will take you here where you can download Forge. It's actually quite easy. You just make sure 1.11's hovered over, bolt it there, and then you click on Installer. It'll take you off to Add Focus. The reason it does that is because Forge has to make some money off of Forge development. It's what they do. So they need to make some money and they do it using Add Focus. We can go ahead and click Skip, and there is Forge downloading. Now we may have to keep it, and we do. And now if we minimize our browser, there it is. Now, if it's not on your desktop, it's most likely in your downloads folder. To find that, hit the Windows button in the top. Type in Downloads. It'll, it'll do it. It's not working right now. See, this is why I don't like Windows 10. Bugs and stuff. Hit the Windows key on your keyboard and R at the exact same time, and you can type in Downloads. Here, hit Enter, and it will launch. As you can see, 1.11 Minecraft server's in there, but if Forge is in there for you, just drag it to your desktop, and you're good to go. Now. Installing Forge in 1.11 is super, super simple. Just right click on it, open with Java TM Platform SE Binary. Click Install Client, click OK, and you've installed it. There you go. Successfully installed Forge Client Profile. Awesome stuff. Click OK again. Open up your games folder. Well, you don't have to open up your games folder. I do. Open up Minecraft, and uh, then you'll be good to go. You'll be good to launch into Forge by just clicking on the Forge Profile over here and clicking play normally but it actually didn't do that so one of the things you want to watch is to make sure down at the bottom right here it says actually 1.11 forge in some way if it doesn't hit edit profile and instead of use latest version or whatever it says here scroll down to the very bottom and you'll see release 1.11 dash forge click that click save profile now you'll see 1.11 dot 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 that means forge is installed go ahead and click play and It'll launch Minecraft 1.11 running Forge. Really simple stuff. Forge is so easy to install now. I remember back in like 1.3 Minecraft, it was incredibly difficult, and specifically back in beta, it was super difficult to install Forge. But now it's just a couple clicks and it's installed. You got to make sure you're on the right version, but after that, you're good to go. And boom, there you go. 1.11 Forge is installed up and running and ready to go. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You can also click right above my face to uh, go see how to install Forge mods because Forge is one thing, but you want to put some more mods into here. So go check out that video see how to do that. This has been The Breakdown. Thank you so much for watching. I am out. Peace.